Sorry, we have been getting a lot of calls on here. Who is on your ballot? One of the choices for president is Lucifer Just In Case Every Love. A voter who saw that name reached out to us asking if her ballot was actually valid. KSL investigator Courtney Johns confirmed the ballot is real, actually spoke with the person who is running for office here. And uh, this is interesting, isn't it? It's very interesting. And a lot of people, a lot of viewers like yourself, have been calling asking about this. And having nicknames on a ballot is nothing new. And while some have caused the lieutenant governor's office to have conversations with candidates, in this case, they never considered it because Mr. Everylove met every qualification under state law, and that is their job, to enforce state law. We're working with the legislature this year to take another look at that um, because I do think it's important, you know, that the, the ballots do reflect individuals that um, are actually using, using names that they're known by, those kind of things. So the nicknames can be a little bit problematic. So while here at KSL, we have gotten several calls about this. Director of Elections Ryan Cowley says they haven't received any. As for this candidate, Every Love, he insists that's actually his real name, adding that he legally changed it about five years ago. And we found Utah court documents with his name, Lucifer Every Love, going as far back as 2022. Utah is the only state with him on the ballot. Every Love says his candidacy sends a message. We do not support what's going on in this country. We don't support what's going on in this world. And um, we want to. So Every Love is one of seven candidates running for president in Utah and one of three who are not affiliated with any party. So if you have any questions about the voting process, please send them to us at our KSL Investigates Vote Watch team. You'll find a Vote Watch tip form at the top of KSLTV.com or you can shoot us a text or call us at 385-707-6153. Also, for future reference, people always look at those ballots, want to know if they're real or yeah. they're fake. You can go to vote.utah.gov, and then you can look at those sample ballots to compare to make sure that that is, in fact, the correct ballot. It's a legitimate question that we got yeah, from people, right? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you might want to take a double take, so it's important to make sure and... We looked into it. We're happy to look into any other questions you may have as well. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks for breaking that down, mm -hmm. Courtney. All right, the state has made it pretty easy to keep an eye on your ballot. All you got to do is head on over to trackmyballot.utah.gov to keep an eye on where it's at and when it has been accepted.